Hey everybody, Tony Gohard here yet again. Um, today I'm going to be making some micheladas real quick. Just a few things that you're going to need. Uh, some black pepper. This is a pepper grinder that I actually like to use a lot because it makes it taste really good. This is some Worcestershire. You use hot sauce. I like to use Tabasco. I've got a lime right over here just off screen. Of course, favorite beer. And some, uh, this is lemon lime salt. This is what I'm going to use to rim the glass. And then, of course, some uh, clam, tomato, clamato. We're gonna put all of that together. And normally I use a bigger cup, but for the sake of this video, I'm gonna be using this one because it is, uh, well, it's clear. You can see it better. So let's see. First, I'm gonna get this stuff ready for salting. I'm just gonna pour some of this. You can use a plate or whatever and it'll work out just fine. Next, uh, this is actually gonna be for the very end, but we are going to get some lime juice around the rim, just like that. And then I'm gonna work this all around right there. And I'll probably lick the rest of that up later. Uh, let's see. I guess I might as well put this bad boy on here right now. We'll put that there so that it looks nice. Um, just a bit of pepper uh, everything is just a taste you know the way that you like it so for this I'm gonna put a few good little taps of that right there of hot sauce and then just a little bit of Worcestershire I can get it in there without spilling it all over the thing so let's see that 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 and we will put just a bit of this some people put ice in theirs. I don't really like to. It kind of makes it taste, well, obviously watery, but that and I don't like my drinks to be too cold. And then of course, some lime juice right there. Get that all squeezed up, get all that delicious citrusy goodness in there. And of course, the beer. Or kind of slow because it does still fizz up. It doesn't fizz up as crazy, so I'm not going to tilt the glass, but the bubbles make it look pretty nice too, so I'm going to do it still slow, still slow, and the way that this glass is shaped, uh, it does bubble up kind of a bit more, so we're just going to give it a little bit like that, and then I'm going to tap this out, transfer the straw right there, and yeah starting to come over the edge a little bit see some of that salt starting to rain down and there we go that's all there is to it like I said you can put some ice everything is to taste however you want to make it spicier a little bit more Worcestershire a little bit more clammy either way it works and it's always going to come out awesome because you're the one who made it so you know exactly how you want it delicious so that's the end of the video. Hit the like button, subscribe, share, drop comments, all that stuff. And I'll catch you all in the next one.